what is up guys it is the cloud brothers and today we're gonna be taking on the lighthouse map in michael zombies i'm gonna be telling you guys from start to finish every single step you guys need to take in order to escape the island it's actually not too hard to be honest so step one guys what you want to do is you want to fill up the soul box you gotta let them get pretty close but you see take that one you get every single kill into the soul all you gotta do is kill them around here deposit their souls you have 50 souls in here and then that turns on the power for all the perks yep so once you kill the 50 you get all the power it's pretty simple just gotta make sure they're pretty close to it because if you kill them like as they're walking up over here then it won't count yep okay. It amazes me how well they can actually make this game. Uh, so much better than the cop. <laughs> I, just, get there, dude, get I just went, I literally just like instantly went down. Like it wasn't even like you got hit, it just went, it just died. So over here you have like this 10,000 uh, door. You really don't need to open this. I'll show you where it leads to because it's just inside of this building here. I guess you could open it if you really need like maybe even later rounds it's easier to train or something i don't know but to be fair you, you don't you just don't really need it so we go through here go in this building and go back here there's a question mark uh there's gonna be like this cabinet it's gonna cost 1000 to open it and then 1500 for the ore first i was like what is this but it's actually your melee weapon and it's gonna one shot them up to i'm not exactly sure what round it is but it was like round i think it's like round 11 round 10. yeah so just, it just makes things so much easier. Alright guys, so once you fill up the souls, like we said, all the perks come on, all the power comes on, so Jug is right by you, you hear the little jingle, and then all the perks are just around the map, you don't have to open. They're all just down here, if you want to get them. I would advise only getting Jug, um, because the next step is actually getting the ray gun. So you kind of just have to meticulously hit the box uh, until you get the ray gun. Every single time I've noticed is the box always starts up here too, so... That's a good point, yep. But yeah, you don't really need anything else besides Jug, honestly. And then Pack-a-Punch, um, power-ups do spawn so that they instantly Pack-a-Punch your weapon for no cost. And we saw like four of them in the first game and then zero in the second. So it seems like they're quite rare. Hopefully we get the ray gun here early. Yeah. Oh, I got the PPSH though. Oh, oh. I am set. I'm sorry, you hit it. Hey, <laughs> yo. Yeah. Ah! Oh, it's so easy. <laughs> And then we can just do it. So show them, since you have ray gun, show them how to like turn on. What? I'll show you where we need to shoot. There's a satellite up here, so we're gonna need to shoot this satellite. But in order to turn it on, you're gonna need to turn on this power trap down here. So I'll turn it on. The electricity trap, 2K. Once that's on, it should kind of like have electrical signal. I'm just gonna shoot that. And then that's gonna signal the lighthouse. And then you'll see it'll be a little while. It takes a few minutes for the boat to get here, but the boat will show up. And then you can exfil. But the boat's actually gonna it's gonna cost some points. It's gonna cost a lot of points. It's gonna cost a bit of points, I mean. So as you guys can see, you can kind of see the boat a little bit, but it just slowly just creeps up over time, so it's a little annoying, but you gotta save up. You might as well just. We did buy speed cola, but you might as well just try to save up your points and you don't. You don't need to buy any of the this door or anything. Well, it's almost there. All right. Okay. So as you can see, we can deposit ten thousand points out of sixty thousand. So I'm gonna do that. So we have twenty k out of sixty. So we're one third of the way there. And basically, you just gotta survive. So this is where it gets a little bit, a little bit rough, but. Again, you have the, the ray gun, at least one of you, so you should try it. 
Or if you are solo, you're gonna have the ray gun anyways. There you go. All right, here we go. Do you have enough? The 60. Oh, I'm in the boat. Yeah. He's in oh, the he's boat. In the boat he made it. Let's go. Oh, 23 kills. Yeah, this thing goes so slow. <laughs> like that, it's over. It's easy. Took us to around 18. 18 it's actually not too bad. Yeah. I mean, we did it pretty much as fast as you could. Yeah. The only, the only real way to get a little bit faster is with the ray gun, like right away, basically. Yeah, or maybe solo because you're not like yeah. splitting points.